This is JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Dean Perrine, and welcome to JSA TV. We are coming at you live from Encompass 2016 in the Lone Star State of Texas, Dallas, Texas to be exact. And I am here with Mr. Cliff Kane. Cliff is the co-CEO of Clarion, and Mr. Kevin Rocks. Kevin is the executive vice president of sales and marketing for Clarion. Guys, thank you for joining us on JSA TV. Thank you for having us over, Dean. You bet. Thank you too, Kevin. Dean, always a pleasure. <laughs> you bet, guys. I, I'm going to start. Uh, I'm going to start with Cliff. Cliff, how is the show going for you? It's been terrific. We are just wall-to-wall -wall meetings, and just can't uh, can't get enough. It's been great so far. Outstanding. So, um, Cliff, I'm going to ask you a, a question that the answer to was a little different last time we spoke. Why don't you tell our viewers a little bit about Clarion? Uh, so, Clarion has. Uh, just made a very successful acquisition of Pangea Networks. So as you know, we started life as a dark fiber provider, but now we are firmly into the lit services business. Very good, very good. So let's talk a little bit about that, um, that new news. It's big news, right? And Kevin, you were a big part of that big news. Why don't you tell us a little bit about the acquisition? Yeah, we're really happy about it, especially because Clearion brings a lot of dark fiber assets and a lot of back office support that really takes Panmetro Ethernet, which is the flagship product of Pangea Networks, mm -hmm. now part of Clearion, that we've been driving in the industry now for wholesale carriers for the past eight years. And now with Clearion's resources, we're going to be able to take this product to hundreds of new buildings in and around the New York metropolitan area. We're really excited about that. So you're, you're the new EVP, so why don't you tell our viewers where you came from? I came from Pangea Networks. <laughs> I, 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 I was the CEO and the founder along with a partner and um, basically been doing this for almost 10 years now prior to the acquisition from Clarion. All right, I'm going to ask you guys to put on your, um, your, your, your predictive caps. If you could predict what the company is going to look like, say, in a year, what might that look like? Well, so what I can tell you is that we're going to really focus on developing uh, the Pangea assets, the Pangea customers and the Clearion customers and Clearion assets, and we'll probably look to build some more backbone next year and maybe even another acquisition. Outstanding. So we recently, you recently went with a, uh, had a press release go out about being service ready. Why don't you tell our viewers a little bit about that? Well, so at Clearion, we like to make, uh, put, out, put forth meaningful press releases. We don't... Uh, just the blast almost anything out there that some of our competitors might do. But the, the whole idea of making that announcement is because we've nailed down all of our back office uh, you know, systems, we've nailed down our fiber to where we know where everything is, and we've also uh, imported all of the, uh, the Pangea uh, assets and, and network into our system. So we're ready to be of service completely 100%. Very, very exciting. And so uh, my final question, I'm going to kick it back over to you, um, Kevin. Um, customers, what do they look like? What's your ideal customer? Um, what might our viewers might need to know as far as uh, the kind of service you provide and to who you provide it to? Wholesale carriers, both on a domestic and international level. Many of these global carriers have offices around the world, but they can't be very dense in each and every market in each and every city globally. What Clearion provides these, these carriers is more of a dense network in New York City, for example. And what happens is a lot of these carriers end, actually end up white labeling a lot of the services that we provide as their own because we make it simple to connect to them vis-a-vis -vis an NNI or some type of other connection at a data center, which helps expand their products. So we're really the feet on the street for a lot of out-of-market domestic carriers, international carriers, ISPs, technology companies, etc. Outstanding, guys. I'm not going to keep you any longer. Um, receptions tonight, are you going to go to some? Absolutely. I'm going to get all of them. <laughs> Very good. Very good. And how about you? Are you going to join this guy? Absolutely. I heard JSA TV is having a, f a function this evening. We'll be, at the, we'll be there. We'll be the first ones there. Yeah, I'll be on an airplane, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Dean. Guys, thank you so much. Thanks, Dean. Thank you, Dean. You bet. And thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV. We'll see you soon.